suddenly jerks alive and it, I jumped several scenes prior to this similar thing I jumped I realized like wow this movie makes you jump right you ever ask yourself that I watch this movie Doctor Strange right in the multiverse of madness and fun movie I realized after several times of, of doing it by the time I'm like three quarters through so this movie makes me jump right like I see that you know Wong gets cast off a mountainside and he's balanced precariously we see him like is he alive is he dead the scene opens up his arms dangling not even enough space to lay down on the ledge right and then finally he jerks up and I jumped and I like I'd said I'd done that a couple other times kind of reactive you know good times but so I says this movie makes me jump you know what I mean like you know and you guys comment below you talk like that to yourself because I suddenly realized how disempowering that whole thing was but it was from the Neville Goddard perspective the I make my reality perspective it was in fact like I realized the movie doesn't make me jump and here's this dialogue I'm like how debilitating to have that to keep casting that out to project that to be in that I realized like a superhero in flies Neville Goddard I realized I just fall had fallen see even there caught myself on film there you go. Just gotta catch yourself. Starts there. Starts there. And realize you had fallen into another state. I had fallen into another state. Lift me out of that state. You ever notice that? Listen to his words, man. I'm just here to bring to the table what I have to to offer for all of us. Because that's all it is, right? Coming together. But I'll tell you what's up. I became aware of the falling into a state and the rising into another one. It's shocking to become aware and risen through and above the thought. It starts with awareness of self. It really is. You know it. That's why you're compelled. If you're if if you're here then like me you probably listen to a lot of neville stuff and like me you you probably actually heard some of my other more recent stuff where i'm kind of like turning a fucking light on you know what i mean and like like dude what's up with this like is this really happening you see how abusive just self-talk because that's what it is it's demeaning it ain't christly is it if i declare it there it is why would I declare it? Can you imagine that's the language? Isn't it wonderful that I've walked away from that? Isn't it wonderful? You know, say what you will about all the plastic shamans. Say what you will about all the kind of glitzy social media trend writing. Whatever you want to call Whatever I've experienced. And I'm assuming, because the video that I made, <laughs> right up there, the video that I made that kind of pops the lid, if you will, on like how some people seem to get the bulk of the material. Show me a lecture where at least, at least 65% isn't friggin' biblical or Christly in some way. Show me something that isn't really, you know, it's about getting your SP, right? Or getting, you know, and there's nothing, like I said, nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that, but you should probably fix whatever's broken in your narrow self-perception that you need that other person to somehow complete you because that other person is only an aspect of you that's clearly starving and in need of love and attention don't you realize that jesus christ is in you right i don't know man you know 
Let's ride the wave, ladies and gentlemen. I just got a hundred subscribers a couple of days ago. Yes, thank you. you. Like me thank you. Right thank now. you, Sally Field. You like right, me. you know. But spread the word. Let's light the place up, man.